Aloha, hello, hola, hi, konnichiwa. Well, aloha everyone, Electra here. How are you doing today? It is yet another hump day, June 21st of 2023. Yes, it's already almost the end of June, you guys. I cannot believe that. But it's another hot, hot day. Oh my God. So if you are outside, please stay hydrated and wear nice, cool, comfortable clothes. Right now, I am wearing one of my shirts that I bought at the Goodwill. I actually did a video on my thrift, I think I called it thrifting. I believe the title was called Thrifting. I did it, uh, I guess, a couple of videos uh, prior to this one. Um, and this is the shirt that I picked up, and I totally love this shirt. I'm wearing it today. Yay! You get to see it on. And the puma looks like it's getting ready to attack. Ah! And I'm loving this shirt because it's a really cool material. I love the color. I love the black puma on here. It's a nice shirt to wear right now because it is so super hot outside. So wear nice, cool, comfortable clothes and stay hydrated. I mean, you even need to stay hydrated when you're inside. I'm drinking this today. Well, yesterday I had like three of these, I believe. Cheers, mateys. So good. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys a video um, about coconut milk. I've been drinking coconut milk for about a month and a half, I think, and I'm so loving it. So I wanted to share with you guys the benefits of coconut milk, and we will get into that here in a little bit. But first of all, I want to begin by by saying thank you to everyone who has been following me on my YouTube channel. Thank you so very much for all of your continuous love and support. Also, thank you for following me on my Electronite Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Insta, my IG, and on my social media platforms, and my Twitch, of course. Don't forget about my Twitch. So if you haven't followed me on Twitch, go follow me now. I will be live on Twitch this Friday, everyone. <clears throat> Excuse me. I will be doing a full face of makeup using my new House Lab foundation to show you how it covers my rosacea on my cheeks. So you don't want to miss that one. Uh, but yes, I just want to say thank you to everyone out there. I love you guys. Mwah! And also want to say thank you to the Firefox Foundation for uh, your sponsorship today for the Cash App. Thank you so very much. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you. And if anybody wants to um, send some Cash App to for a sponsorship, it helps with my YouTube, with my social media channels. It helps with my uh, weight loss journey. It, it helps with a lot of stuff. Um, that Electronite needs and Little Terror as well. My little kitties too. Uh, just send sponsorship to I Electra. It's for my Cash App. I E L E K T R A. Thank you, everyone. It's greatly appreciated. Thank you. Mwah, I love you guys. Okay, so shall we get started with the coconut milk? I'm gonna put you guys on a quick little standby, and I will be right back. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back, you guys. Stand by. Hey everyone, I'm back. Am I in the center? I think I am now. Okay, I'm back. So this is the coconut milk that I have been uh, drinking and I really, really love it. It is by Silk Coconut Milk and it's unsweet. 
it has no sweetener. I think they have some that is sweet, but I chose the no, the unsweetened because I don't want any sugar. And it does contain 40 calories. Coconut milk, delicious in every dish and drink. And let me tell you, this is, I've tasted coconut milks before. <clears throat> they don't, <clears throat> excuse me. They don't really have the coconut milk taste. This one right here has the coconut milk flavor. It is so delicious. Um, it's especially when it's nice and cold. Of course, you want to have milk when it's nice and cold, right? So it is, I mean, it tastes just like the coconut that's pictured right here. It really, really does. And we are going to check the nutrition label. But it is so delicious, everyone. If you haven't tried it and you don't want to drink just regular milk, you like to drink, say, like coconut milk or if you're drinking almond milk, because I've had almond milk before. And let me tell you, I'm so glad that I made a change from almond, almond milk to this silk um, coconut milk because for me, it's a lot better. It tastes better. And not only that, the consistency, it's a lot creamier <clears throat> as opposed to the almond milk that it's kind of, the consistency is kind of watery. This one is a nice kind of thick, creamy milk. And it is just, I can't, I can't stress enough how delicious it is, you guys. Can't, can't. Okay, <clears throat> let's get into it, shall we? It does contain 40 calories. One cup contains, the serving size is one cup. And it's got total fat, four grams. Saturated fat, four grams. It's got no trans fat, zero grams of cholesterol. And it only contains 45 milligrams of sodium. It only has, <clears throat> excuse me, it only has two grams of total carbohydrates. Absolutely no sugar. It has zero sugar. Yes, you heard that right. It has zero sugar. So those of you that are on a no sugar diet or you cannot consume any sugar whatsoever, this would be a really good choice for you because it is really, really tasty. Okay, and it does not contain any protein. No protein whatsoever. Vitamin D, it has 10% of vitamin D. It's got 2% of iron, 20% um, vitamin A, and B12. It's got 35% of B12. Calcium, 35%. Potassium, 6%. Vitamin E, 20%. So this is a really, this milk is really good and healthy for you. We are going to look up the benefits of coconut milk. <clears throat> Excuse me. Here are the top five benefits of coconut milk. Let me see if I can see these. Okay. Um, okay. Sometimes when you're looking for stuff, they just give you a whole bunch of, I don't know what other thing. Okay, well, for starters, it is lactose free. Unlike cow's milk, coconut milk is lactose free, so it can be used as a milk substitute for those with lactose who are lactose intolerant. So that's a good thing. If you're lactose intolerant, you can substitute that with coconut milk. I know quite a few people that are lactose intolerant. And again, it has anti-inflammatory and antimicrobial and antifungal properties. Okay. It 
It destroys a wide variety of disease-causing organisms. It's therefore thought that the consumption of coconut milk and other coconut derived foods may help protect the body from infections and viruses so if you want to get your immune system a little bit on the healthier side <clears throat> coconut milk will actually help you uh help you do that it will help your body get healthier and protect it from certain what was it from certain infectious and infectious and and by vi infectious viruses so that's a good thing it may support cardiovascular health which we all need to take care of our cardiovascular health um, let me see it's some re recent studies are suggesting that the facts no that the fats from coconut may not have such a a determined determinal effect on uh, uh on blood liquids cholesterol balance and cardiovascular health as once thought this is certainly certainly one area of re research to watch okay and then it may reduce stomach ulcers i knew when i was um doing a personal training when i had my fitness studio i had a i had a client that had stomach ulcers so he would always have to go to the hospital and stuff you know he had stomach ulcers nobody wants to have stomach ulcers right okay so it may reduce stomach ulcers which is really good one animal study found coconut milk reduced the size of a stomach ulcer by the same amount as that of an anti-ulcer drug. <clears throat> Further studies confirm the mechanism for this is partly due to the milk's anti-inflammatory properties in combination with positive effects on the growth of the mu what is that? Mu mucosa mucosa okay oh no and then also is coconut milk safe for everyone here we go that is a question that a lot of people may ask is coconut milk safe for everyone just like if you would ask um are peanuts safe for everyone because you know there's people out there that have that have a allergic reaction to peanuts their peanut butter their throat might close up or something you know because they have that allergic reaction so they stay away from peanut butter and peanuts so okay here we go allergic reactions to coconut are rare <clears throat> excuse me although contact dermatitis and sensitization sen sen sensitization <laughs> to the tree to the tree pollen is more often seen coconuts are one of those foods that uh, oscillate between the good and bad food camps coconut milk especially the lower fat variety can be used in moderation up to two times per week however the British Heart Foundation recommends swapping saturated fats and sources of them, including coconut oil, for unsaturated varieties. <clears throat> so, there you have it. Coconut milk is pretty, it's very beneficial for your health. And if you want to improve your immune system, um, coconut milk can help you achieve that. So this brand specifically right here, if you can find this one and you want, would like to try it, please do. I highly recommend this one. And it's unsweet. I think it, it, it was established 1977 in Boulder, Colorado. 
And this, believe me when I tell you, this coconut milk, it's very delicious. It is so delicious that you just want to keep drinking it. That's how good it is, especially when it's nice and cold. I use this for my protein shakes. <clears throat> Excuse me. I use it for my protein shakes. And then <clears throat> I'm getting parched. And then um, Sunday morning, I had a small bowl of cereal. And it's not the little kid. Um, it's not the little kid sugary. What was it? What is it? Chocolate um, cereal or Frosted Flakes or anything like that. It was a healthy cereal. It was just Cheerios. You know, Cheerios, I like plain Cheerios because they do help your, your heart and they they help lower cholesterol and all that good stuff i don't have high cholesterol or anything like that but to prevent it so that's why i like just playing cheerios and i put this milk in there and i put like three packets of splenda oh my god i was in heaven it is so delicious so i use it for that as well and you can also just have it as a treat um, you can mix your coconut milk. You can mix it with some low sugar or, yeah, some low sugar Hershey's, Hershey syrup, um, chocolate syrup. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Some chocolate syrup. And you have yourself like a delicious chocolate milk. It's like a guilty pleasure, you know. So that would be really good. You can you can have the milk with milk and cookies. I have bought some sugar-free chocolate chip cookies. <coughs> Excuse me, you guys. Sorry. I I bought some sugar-free chocolate chip cookies, but I haven't tried it with a glass of milk yet. I might just do that later on. I might do that later on this evening when I come back from the gym. But we'll see. Uh, and I know it's going to taste good because this milk tastes good with everything. Now, I haven't really cooked with coconut milk because uh, I really don't make like a lot of recipes that have coconut milk. Well, all I really cook is like chicken and um, ground beef and I don't know. some. I guess some stuff I cook with milk. Mashed potatoes or macaroni and cheese. When I do cook macaroni and cheese. Uh, but I have not used coconut milk in any of those dishes yet, yet. Uh, but I don't know if I want my mac and cheese tasting like coconut. <laughs> I think for now, I'm just going to stick with my protein shakes and my cereal. <laughs> but mainly my protein shake. My cereal, this is the first time I had a bowl of cereal in a very long time. I don't normally eat cereal. Uh, but I did buy some Cheerios. They already come in this small little bowl. You just peel the little package off and just pour your milk in there. So it's very convenient. And that's what I did. Um, but yes, I'm going to, if I were to rate this a one through five, I would totally rate this a five. Like a perfect five, everyone. That's how good this milk is. Really, really good. I've tried, like I said, I've tried so many milks milks out there. Uh, skim milk. Totally hate skim milk with a passion. Um, I don't like it. It's so, the consistency is like water, no flavor. Just gross. I've tried, the almond milks is good, but not as good as this one. I've tried, I, what else have I tried? Mm. oat milk now i do like the oat milk oat milk is really good i've tried the oat milk creamy <clears throat> the creamier version and all that i've tried that too i do like oat milk but <clears throat> this is way lower in calories and sugar so for me right now i'm going to stick to this maybe i'll have oat milk in my starbucks um coffee every now and then but not to have for my protein shakes and anything else so for now it's going to be silk coconut milk unsweet coconut milk for this girl all the way for a good while 
Now, Silk, you need to hire me to represent your brand. <laughs> But yes, everyone, it's very delicious. You can find it at your local grocery store. Uh, if I do remember correctly, I think this was the sell pro not on sale, but what it cost, I believe it was probably about a little over $4, under $5, let's just say that. But it's worth it because it does last a long, well, not that long. I think I've had this for like maybe three weeks about there so it does last for a little for a while it depending on how, how much you use it i just use it uh for my protein shakes in the mornings and that's pretty much it so i think that's why it lasted me about three weeks um and i do also use splenda in my protein shakes but if i do crave like a nice cold glass of milk sometimes i uh, i do have a cup of the coconut milk and i just open two packets of splenda and i drink the milk just like that and it is delicious trust me it is delicious you guys well anyway that is the video for today i hope that you enjoyed it this coconut milk video if that makes any sense <laughs> but uh, yeah i hope you go out and try it and if you do so happen to pick uh to pick up some silk coconut milk unsweet remember uh leave me a comment down below and let me know how you enjoyed it let me know if you liked it disliked it or you know all those all that good stuff um, but until then, I will be live this Friday via Twitch, probably about, mm, probably about 5, 5.15, okay, between there. But I'll go ahead and I'll post it on my fan page and Twitter account as well to give you guys a heads up. Okay, so stay tuned for that. And also, don't forget to check out my shorts on YouTube. And I do have my members area that is already open. So all you have to do to join my members area is hit that button that says members. Oh, my nose is just... And that's it. And I do, just to uh, remind everyone, on my members area, I do post uh, things, photos that are not seen on my social media at all they're totally different uh photos and everything that no one has seen so they're really different just for the members as they do get special perks so keep that in mind okay well until then i will see you guys soon have a wonderful wonderful wednesday have fun on this hump day whatever it is you may be doing have fun and stay safe and stay hydrated everyone please stay hydrated i'm going to be on my way to the gym i do have a different workout for this week and next week and let me just tell you it is a very challenging workout that my uh my trainer gave me my trainer coach gave me and let's just say I was not very happy with it, but I have to do it. I have a goal to accomplish and I have to do this workout, but it's okay. I'll get it done. But I'll go into that workout later on in another video. Until then, you guys have a wonderful day. Mwah. Bye, everyone. I love you guys. Yay! Shimmy, 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 shimmy. Okay, <laughs> bye. World peace and good health and all that jazz. All that jazz. Bye.